In the second part of this series, we will demonstrate soil sampling using traditional methanol preservation. Here you can see a calibration weight on a balance because the methanol vials the field crew uses has to be weighed prior to use. Here the sample is being collected from the baggie with a cutoff syringe and then the sample is put into a methanol vial. That is not the recommended procedure. It is required in some states but it is not recommended. Some state regulators should be looking at a change in methodology because this procedure creates a strong negative bias. From the sample baggie, soil is also taken for a dry weight. This is required for every sample that is sent to the laboratory. This sample has to be taken from the same interval from which the methanol preserved sample is taken. You do not need to fill a full container like this. You could use a syringe and take several syringe samples and put them into the jar. So this could be done more quickly. To spend this amount of time preparing the sample is fairly typical in the field, but in most cases, time is of the essence. Here you see them capping the container. Then the dry weight sample and the methanol preserved vials are labeled and packed on ice to be sent to the lab for analysis.